In this video, we have the function y of x satisfies the differential equation y cubed dy by dx is equal to x plus y, and the condition y of 0 equals 2. So when x is 0, y is 2. Use Euler's step-by-step -step method with a step length of 0.05 to obtain an estimate of the value of y of 0.15. Give your answer to three decimal places. OK, so we have, first of all, not the correct form. So we need it to be of the form dy by dx equals some function of x and y. So I'm going to divide both sides by y cubed to get dy by dx is equal to x plus y over y cubed. Just uh, rewrite that three there. There we are. Uh, OK, so... From here, we know that x0 zero is 0, so the initial value of x is 0, and the initial value of y, so y0 zero is 2. OK, and what we want is y1, and using this formula here, we know that that's going to be y0 plus the step length, 0 0.05, times by f of um, 0, 2. So y0 is 2 plus 0.05 times by. So we've got to substitute 0, x0, y2 into that right-hand side there. So we're going to have uh, 0 plus 2 over 2 cubed. So 1 quarter, so 0 0.25. So 0 0.25 times 0 0.05 plus 2 gets me 2 0.0125. So that's my y1. So find the corresponding x value, which is going to be the previous x value, sorry, not x2, x1, which is going to be the previous x value, x0, plus h, which is the 0 0.05. So x0 here is 0. And of course, that's 0 0.05. Okay. So now we can find y2. So y2 will be the previous y value, y1, plus the step length, 0 0.05, times by f of um, x1, y1. Now x1 is 0 0.05, and y1 was 2.0125. 2.0125. So y1, 2.0125 plus 0 0.05 times by, substitute x is 0 0.05, y is 2.0125 into that. So we've got uh, 0 0.05 plus 2.0125 divided by 2.0125 cubed. So that's 0 0.25303861169. We're going to times that by 0 0.05, add on 2.0125, and we get 2.02515191616. So that's y2. OK, so x2 will be x1 plus the step length. So x1 was 0 0.05 plus 0 0.05 is equal to 0 0.1. OK, so... We now need y3, because that's not quite right. We need to get to 0 0.15, so we need to go one more stage. So y3 is y2 plus the step length, 0 0.05, times by f of x2, which is 0 0.1, at y2, which is this 2.02515191916. So y2, 2.02515. 15916, not 251511. There we are. I thought something was missing. 1916 uh, plus 0.05 times by. So I need to substitute that in there. So we've got 0.1 plus 2.02515191916 divided by 2.025. 151916 cubed, which is 0 0.2558686981. Now I'm timesing that by 0 0.05, 
and adding on 2.02515196 and we get 2.0379453512. Now the corresponding x value here, uh, so x3 would be uh, the previous term x2 plus 0 0.05 which of course was 0 0.1 plus 0 0.05, which is your 0.15. So this is the x value that we wanted to get to, and we found the corresponding y value, which is that. So to three decimal places, y3 is 2.038. Uh, so 2.038. To three decimal places.